Hello everyone, my name is Kelly and I'm the community manager at Game Analytics. So in this video, I'm going to be going over our standard dashboards. So in here, you will be able to find all the top dashboards that you can use for your game, which shows the most important metrics needed to monitor the health of your game. So this includes the number of new users you have gained, the number of new users for top countries that you have gained, your DAO, it stands for daily active users for those of you who don't know, your average section lengths, and your retention from day one to day seven. Next, you'll be able to see the engagement dashboard, which shows you the number of retained players each day and month and engagement in terms of sessions and play time. So as you can see over here. And next we have benchmarks, which shows how your game is performing compared to other titles on the game analytics network. So as you can see, there's retention day one, Retention day 7, retention day 28, conversion, updow, which stands for average revenue per daily active user, your session length, and ARPU, which stands for average revenue per paying user. You will also be able to access the monetization dashboard when you're using our tool. So here, it shows you the revenues generated by your game. So here you go, the different transactions, the conversion rates, updow, upro again, paying users, revenue per item, pretty much all of your in-app purchases. You will also be able to access the resources dashboard where it shows you how in-game resources like virtual currencies, um, XP, and lives that are spent and earning your game. And then there's also the progression dashboard which shows you how players are completing levels in your game and gives insights into how difficult your game is based on the level completion and scores. And last but not least, there's the quality dashboard, which breaks down the error events triggered by your players. So from the menu panel on the left, you can also access the custom dashboard feature. So here is where you can pick and choose the widgets you want to look at. Custom dashboards gives you the ability to look at the data that matters to you in a single place instead of having to look through our pre-made dashboards. Also, if you don't want to start a dashboard from scratch, you can easily build on top of our predefined dashboards simply by duplicating them. So that's pretty much it. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope you learned a bit more about our platform today. Uh, by the way, there's a ton of information on our documentation page, so make sure you take a look. And if you have any questions, please feel free to send a message to our support team at support at gameanalytics.com. Thank you again.